at this point in the video, what, missing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. we have just come through the window right, well, well, and two police officers have just come in yeah. to try and look for two Irish lads that are missing Literally, in Manchester. Uh, Literally. Around the ages like of Like two um, seconds. As soon as you basically come, we've just basically got our cameras out. <laughs> that was Both about brothers. it. So we tried helping the police to try and search the area. What? No, we couldn't find mind. them. Later in the day, no, we've just been, been found. No, nah, we've not walked around it. We've just come here now. June. Basically, just stood here. But yeah, anyway, guys, supposedly there's uh, two 12 year old kids that are missing now. So obviously, we're going to have a look around here in this building now and see if we can find them anyway, guys. Obviously, police are there uh, doing the job. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. We'll just wait here. <laughs> So yeah guys, we are in the old, abandoned, showcase cinema in Gorton. It's going to be uh, renovated and changed into a school in a couple of weeks. Yeah, this is uh, basically going to knock it down, some of it, keep the full building, and then uh, they're building a school on this premises. So it's either getting kept or demolished. Hey, should we have a picture behind this? So yeah guys, this is where you would come and get your tickets and your popcorn. From inside that, you get your refreshments. See, this is what I'm talking about, vandals. Just come along and just smash everything for absolute no apparent reason. Probably get your hot dogs. See what we've we got here, we've got Ben and Jerry's ice cream. All the rest of it. Oh, they've gone down there into the cinema bit. <laughs> Guys, we are behind the till here. Like some popcorn. Seven up Coke. Got the coffee machines. This is where you'd get your popcorn. Oh, yeah. This is the front entrance anyway, guys. I'm going to let the uh, police do the job, try and find these kids first, and then we'll take you around this building. In March, I you know. Showcase. Another little bit of a snack bar here, where you get your hot dogs, meal four, shake and popcorn. Unlimited cinema gift. A couple of toilets here probably. Yeah. Not in here boys, are ya? No, nope, no kids in there. But yeah, anyway guys, supposedly there's uh, two 12 year old uh, Irish lads on the run uh, from the mothers. So... So we are in the cinema bit at this moment in time guys. This is where all the chairs are. Of the cinema. Right guys, we're going to take you into a different cinema. That's fine. Cheers, Ed. Yeah. Nice one. No worries. So yeah guys, police, police are down there searching the building for uh, two lost 12-year-old uh, kids um, that have run off from their parents. So obviously, we are going into the cinema bits. Yeah, they're going to board us up very soon, so it's a good job we come. 
Yeah, because obviously it's such a big building, two people can't physically do it, can they? But yeah, ta tactical aid are coming. God, they're on me. So yeah, guys, anyway, as we were saying, I'm going to take you around the last little bit, obviously because the police can't uh, leave this building unsealed. Well, yeah, unsealed, that's the word. So they need to uh, block it up. So they said we've got five minutes to get our pictures, get our video, and then go. It's another... Uh, Another room here. This is uh, the projector's room, guys, where basically the camera would go through there and go onto the um, cinema screen. But wow, it's pretty cool in here, guys. Yeah, showcase cinema garden. Guys, here's the old uh, posters that you used to get when the film come out. Blood hot. All different ones there. Look, you've got boxes and boxes of phone ones. All sorts of different ones. It's in the roof, you Yeah, man. You got a good picture up there? What? You got a good picture up there? Alright, so I'm just going to take you quickly round a few rooms here, guys, anyway. Oh, shit. Pirates of the Caribbean. Current week, use box offices. At an office, ladies' toilets. Got a computer room here. Obviously, all the hardware, M&Ms. I'm an M cover. Hey okay, guys, we're coming to this room. I don't know what this is. Goes all the way down there. Here's the office with the bruise at. Four K, two K L. And you've got some mad little lights here, guys, for the projector. Well, that's for uh, winding the old uh, cassette tapes back up. It's pretty cool. You don't see one of them every day, do you? Uh, but yeah, anyway, guys, we're going to get out of here. Go downstairs to the last couple of uh, cinema rooms, and then this building is getting blocked back up. Um, yeah, but we've seen these. These are for the projectors to roll back and forward to go out of there straight into the cinema. It's really cool that. Alright, I'm going to take you back downstairs now guys, yeah, and then I'm going to take you to the other side and then we're going to go. Didn't go into one of these, did we? So yeah guys gonna take you into this side now. I think the police might have gone, I'm not too sure. But um they will be boarding it up very soon down here. 
I know there's somebody down there. <laughs> Clear. All right. So yeah, guys, basically, most of these cinemas are identical. As you can see, they're all exactly the same. Left side to right side. They're all, um, all exactly the same, as you can see. The secret garden. Like this one, it's literally the television has been taken away, or the cinema. So yeah. Right. Uh, we've got a dog coming in now, so we'll have to get that. So yeah, we'll have to go. Yeah. I've yeah, yeah, because I said. So. Right, all right. Um, uh, I've just got to find my mate, and then yeah. we'll go. Yeah. No worries. Open here, mate. So. Right, I've just got to find him. Yeah, yeah, no worries. I'll ring him now anyway. I'll tell him now. Yeah. Thanks for that. No, no, I've just got to ring him because he's still in here. <laughs> but we can get out of this way. No, actually, it's a bit dangerous. What? <laughs> yes, lad. Hey, they're bringing in a dog, so you need to come back to the front. Oh, you're gonna, are you gonna get fucking eaten by a dog? Alright, oh, mate, you're so safe. I know, I know. I'm just, um. Oh yeah, um, they're just um, idiots. Yeah. I'm all for that, people going about and having a look at it and that's when people start smashing stuff. Oh yeah, it. that's what I mean, it does my head in. See, I, I've been doing it for like four or five years and that, so obviously, like you get a bit of a respect for the places that you go to, do you know what I mean? Like That's why I like when I see people like yourselves, it's mm. like wonderful. See, but, me and Mitch, we do it for uh, history's sake. Yeah, for like say, documenting it and that. Yeah, so yeah. say like, 20 years from now, but your kids true. want to see a, p a picture of yeah. where you went or yeah. say anything like that, because say somebody's doing some homework or something like that, yeah. and say we've took the pictures, the pictures are going to be there in 10 years, yeah. 20 Absolutely. years, so obviously kind no, of we're logging the history down before it gets wiped out yeah. no, no, <laughs> of some no. of the buildings, so. Was it like one of the biggest cinemas in Europe or something when it first got built? Oh yeah, yeah, it was, yeah. It's been here for ages, hasn't it? It's getting changed into a school now. Yeah, so that should be all right. At least it's bringing something positive to the area what about the track dog track is that cool? do you know what to be honest i've been thinking about doing that one but at the end of the day i don't know it's 50 50 because they still own it don't they yeah because right. obviously say if it was a went, went into liquidation then it then that's the point is it council on this now don't they? uh they've sold it now they sold i think they think they've sold it i'm not too uh, sure so I thought council bought because showcase. yeah it might actually yeah flat, flat i think they, to build the school, yeah that's it? probably true that that's probably definitely true <laughs> oh no no <laughs> can't get the right pictures and the right videos for the place you off anywhere today or no not really we're just trying to um, stay local really to be honest one more after this and then that's about it but the other one's getting demolished as well so there was an old uh, abandoned factory up uh, on no, louisa street louisa street Clayton. Oh, i've done that one yeah it's, that a, it's a hollow one? shell now is it yeah basically it's just yeah. a forklift in the middle of it and it's just like overgrown next with all bushes yeah, sure. yeah yeah next to the canal yeah i did that a few weeks ago um yeah it's just a shell now Used to be an iron factory, didn't it? Yeah, yeah. Like, uh, and really no, like, what's it called? Wings and radiators. It's like an art artery, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah. Like yeah, basically, they used to do vintage cars back in the day. Um, I forgot what cars they used to be, but they used to be really, really old cars. There's a mansion up in Edenfield. A mansion up. Is, is, that, is that Macclesfield? No, no, Edenfield. It's like just past Ramsbottom. Oh, that's, is that Harncliffe Mansion? Harncliffe Mansion. Mansion. Mansion, yeah, with all the Jaguars and yeah, stuff yeah. like that. Yeah, it's cool there. People were nicking all the pieces. Yeah, yeah. 
Because obviously uh, they're all um, vintage old Jaguars, aren't they? So obviously yeah. the parts on them are probably flipping a few hundred quid, aren't they? But it's fucking sad. Is that the, was that the parents of the people that are missing? I don't think they're in here, to be honest. I can, I can tell you for a fact, they're not in here. They're not in here. Yeah, I see you doing it. I'm not sure what I'm doing. I'm not sure what I'm doing. This when it's gone. There's no cinemas now in Stockport, is there really? Except that flipping crap one. That red rock. Wasted all that money on that horrible looking building, didn't he? <laughs> <laughs> that red rock, it's horrible. Oh, Proper ice sixty. Yeah, yeah. And the cinema's crap. It's like literally there's nowhere else now, is there? Took years to build that. I know. You ever go up to um, the Warner Brothers cinema up before No. No, that was all right. See, I would like that, the Warner Brothers sets yeah. and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. A bit of action myself, but obviously it's one of them. Mm. And uh, now they've opened them like years and years ago. Yeah, yeah. It's really Yeah, it would have been cool, that, to be honest. Mm. Yeah, it's warm in here, though. Mitchie boy. So yeah, anyway guys, it's a bit mad in here. Ooh. Oh, it's soaking. Yeah, the dog's there. Is it? Yeah, well, supposedly. Do you know what, they've been found in it, haven't they? Oh yeah, let's just go anyway and get some pictures from the outside, innit? Yeah, exploring the great case in the come here. Not all the police there, boys. Literally. Great Manchester police. Big shout out to you for letting us go round it, man. Right, guys, anyway, well, there you have it. The old abandoned showcase cinema in Gordon. Thanks for joining. Post notifications, subscribe to me, subscribe to the boys. Peace.